Yo, what's good people? It's Jay Cactus, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make ethnic vocal drill beats. So I'll show you where you can find samples, how you can figure out the key, and of course, how to make your drums bang. I'm going to be working around an acapella from my guy Lats 2, so I know exactly what space I'm going to need. And yo, I definitely think you're going to learn something from this one, so let's get straight into it. Alright, so to make these type of beats, the first thing you're going to need is a vocal because that's going to be the main thing in the beat. Usually for the vocals, I'll either use contact banks or I'll find samples on YouTube. So for contact banks, you could try something like Ethno World 6. You could try lyrical vocal phrases, just any bank that has vocal phrases, or you can sample straight from YouTube. If you're doing it on YouTube, you can literally just type in ethnic vocal samples and people create these playlists so you don't have to do the hard work. And then you could use a free Chrome extension like this one called Sample and this will record directly from YouTube. Obviously, that's going to make it a little bit trickier to clear the sample if you actually want to release the song. So yeah, I'll leave that one up to you, but this is the one that I've taken. So I think this one's perfect. I only needed this little section too. First of all, I just want to figure out the BPM. So I'm going to go to the start of it. We'll just right click on the BPM and go to tap. So it's somewhere around about there. It doesn't matter if you don't get it perfect because I'm going to be chopping it up anyway. So the actual BPM I'm going to work around is 146. I want it to be kind of fast paced because we check the BPM. We could select fit to tempo and just type in, I think it was 109. I'm going to set the sample to stretch. I've got generic bleeding on de-clicking mode. I'm going to hold alt click and drag and just see if I can actually get it in time. I think that's going to be better because I want to take this part here. So I'm just going to chop it at every bar. Now what I like to do when I'm chopping these samples is just have one section that kind of repeats. So like this, for example, this can repeat and then we can switch things up at the end. So like here, we could change something here because we want it to be kind of repetitive. We want it to be dark, so we don't want it changing way too much. So I think that one could go there. Maybe even bring it back. Now I'm just holding Alt and Shift and using the mouse wheel. And this is just going to bring the sample back and forth until it's more in time. Now I'm going to copy this over again. And then again, I'll just change that last one once more. Maybe I could take this part again. Yeah, that sounds crazy. And then leave that last section like I had it before. First thing I'm going to add is like a cleaning EQ, taking out some harsh frequencies. Then I'm just going to add another one. To like filter it out. It's already got some reverb in the sample, but I'm just using a bit more to fill out those gaps. I'm also going to use Ozone Imager. This is just to widen it a bit. And then just a little bit of Shaper Box. This is just panning it to both sides, but I'm bringing down the mix. And last thing before Shaper Box is a compressor. Just to even it out. You know what though, I think this will sound better pitched up a bit. So I'm going to use Sound Shifter. But with these ones, I feel like the 8 weight has to hit on the right note. So I don't want the 8 weight to be too high up. Anywhere between like A sharp and E, even D sharp is alright for these. And to find the key of the sample, usually I'll just try and hum the root note. So yeah, I'm hearing it as D minor. But if you want the lazy way, then just pull up something like mixed in key. So yeah, look, saying D minor or F major, same thing. So if I'm pitching it now, I really don't want to pitch it more than one, to be honest. All right, the vocal sound is sick now. Next, I just want something to sit underneath it and just a constant note so it adds more tension. So something like a string or a pad bank in contact. So we could use Vocalize, one of my favorite banks. You see like this one here, this could work. And then we could just add an EQ to filter out the lows and the highs. See if we could find one more layer too. This could be another one. It sounds hard. Then I'm going to take one more from Balkan Ethnic Orchestra. And this is just going to be the sunrise part. Same thing though, just that one note. This one is just going to be filtered for the top end. One more thing I'm going to add is just a layer of strings. Something like a tremolo. So yeah, really so. I was just going to add like another pad and you could probably hear it, but the only thing it sounds like it's missing is some low end. But obviously the eight weight is going to cover that. But for one part, we could add a sub bass or even some lower strings. So let's try something like this growler sub. Ooh, see how that just completes it. It's sounding hard now.
Now at this point, what you can do is select them all by holding control, clicking and dragging. I'm going to send them to a new insert, just number seven in this case. And I'm going to add kickstart two. And now we get this. So we can have one section normal. Then it can go into this. And that's all the melody really needs. It's all going to be about the drums and the break. So I'm going to bring in Lats's acapella and we'll work around that. All right, let's see what Lats has got. So Look, I ain't doing no talking. the only thing you sent me so far is a hook. Let's see if it works. I ain't doing no talking. But be on a knee, she gon' take this word cause she doing us talking. Yeah, this guy said I'm crazy, you know. Me like no verbal, standard. Don't trust me, I'm bringing out trouble. Me and bro will suck. Alright, let's get a count snare in. So yeah, with these ones, I like to get rid of this one. So I'm going to keep this as the main counter snare, then I'm going to add another to add more bounce. But we could get a few fillers in there. With the second one, I'm just going to keep the end in here. All right, now I'm gonna take this higher count snare and make a bit of a faster pattern, but just have this kind of quiet. Then I'm gonna add a little bit of delay to this one. This is gonna be kind of quiet. All right, let's get a snare in. I ain't doing no talking But be on a knee She gon' take this work Cause she doing us talking Provoking Me not like no verbal Standard Don't trust me I'm bringing out trouble Me and bro will suck On the block Trying to stack up these peas Making it double Peas making it double Talking But be on a knee She gon' take this work Cause she doing us talking Provoking Me not like no verbal Standard Don't trust me I'm bringing out trouble Me and bro will Alright, so I've got the main bounce and I just want to add a couple more perks before I add the kick in 808. So I can do one. Let's try getting a pet like this as well. And then with this one, I'm going to bring everything down because I want to make some smaller. Let's try a different one. And then just a delay on that. Provoking, me not like no verbal standard. Don't trust me, I'm bringing out trouble. Me and bro will suck on the block. Then I've just copied it into this smash perk as well. Provoking, me not like no verbal standard. Don't trust like me, I'm bringing out trouble. Me and, right, and then I think at the end of the eight bar, I'll have some kind of drum fill. Maybe we'll alternate them though. So one can go there, next one can go in this section. All right, now it's time for the eight weight. For the eight weight, I need something gritty like this rider one. Look, I ain't doing no talking. But be on a knee, she gon' take this work cause she doing us talking. Provoking, me not like no verbal. Standard, don't trust me, I'm bringing out trouble. Bro, we'll suck on the block trying to stack up this piece. Bro, we'll suck on the block trying to stack up this piece. Making it. Bro, we'll suck on the block trying to stack up this piece. Making it double. All right, I just wanted a quick pattern in. But we'll get some other slides. I ain't doing no talking. But be on a knee, she gon' take this work. So yeah, I'm gonna slide these up. Right, pan these ones as well. Maybe for this one, it can be a slow glide up. Verbal stand. Provoking, me not like no verbal stand. Bro, we'll suck on the block trying to stack up this piece, making it double. I want two different pans, so that might be the second one, and then have a simpler one before it. So, yeah, just copy that over, and then we'll get rid of these. Uh, look, I, I ain't doing no talking, but be on a knee, she gon' take this work, cause she doing us talking. Provoking, me not like no verbal stand. Right, of course, we're going to use the bass kick, my go-to one every time. Just bring the volume up a little bit. And all I have on the master is just classic clipper. I've got the slope right up and then everything else is left the same. Let's do a quick arrangement. I don't actually have his verses yet, but we can start with a hook and then I'll save some space for the verse. All right, so in the intro, I'm just gonna leave everything out. 
Maybe bring the sub back in. Let's leave the strings out as well. Or maybe up to about here. When it drops the first time, I want everything to cut apart from his vocals and then it can come straight back in. So up until about this point, maybe even these two. Sounding mad. And it wouldn't be a cactus beat without a camera flash. So that might be the perfect place to add it. Then I'll just bring them both down. You know what? I'm going to save this counter snare. I don't need that fast one all the way through. Even that string, I can bring that back in. And in this section, it's going to come into the verse. So yeah, when it gets to the verse, we need some energy to dip. So I'm going to start taking things out. I'll take everything out and then we can start bringing it back in. Might be easier. So the strings. Or maybe just leave this one in. You know what? Maybe we could bring kickstart back here. We need that filler back too. Might get rid of the perks here. And then maybe a pause like here. Alright. And then from this point, let's just bring the hook back. I feel like in this section, something needs to happen just before the drop. So maybe even a filter. Look, I ain't doing no talking. But be on a niche. Yeah, there we go. Something like this. But then I can just slowly bring it off. So like here, I can just make it a steeper curve. Yeah, that's the one. Let's just copy that over to the next hook. Alright, let's listen from the beginning. Okay, so in the intro, melody wise, I left everything apart from the strings. Kind of the same all the way through, but that adds to that tension. And just little bits of variation like this. Look, I ain't doing no talking, so now we've got a kickstart and a count snare. And then the strings for some talking, high energy. Like no verbal, verbal. And this is like a pre-hook. And then coming to the drop. I ain't doing no talking, but be on a niche, you gonna take this work because you're doing us talking. Provoking, me like no verbal standard. Don't trust me, I'm bringing out trouble. Me and bro will suck on a block, trying to stack up this piece, making it double. Strings again. I ain't doing no talking, but be on a niche, you gonna take this work because you're doing us talking. Provoking, me like no verbal standard. Don't trust me, I'm bringing out trouble. Me and bro will suck on a block, trying to stack up this piece, making it double. So you can see all the drums, Doc. Apart from the count snare, and I've just chopped the eight weight a bit. I think this track could come out crazy. Let me know in the comments if you think we need to finish it. Then I'll make sure Lats actually does it. I think in the full track, there'll probably be a few more pauses as well. Depending on his bars in the verse. So, yeah, a little switch up using the sub now. And then back to the hook. I ain't doing no talking, but be on a knee, she go take this work cause she doing us talking, provoking, me not like no verbal, standard, don't trust me I'm bringing out trouble, me and bro will suck on the block trying to stack up this piece, making it double, no, I ain't doing no talking, but be on a knee, she go take this work cause she doing us talking, provoking, me not like no verbal, standard, don't trust me I'm bringing out trouble, me and bro will suck on the block trying to stack up this piece, making it double,